All right, guys. So today, what we're gonna learn how to do is how to do a proper cap raise. A lot of people have complaints on why the calves aren't growing, and it's mainly because I'm gonna tell you. Whenever you're working the muscle, you want to always remember you want to stretch it and you want to shorten it. Doing this for a calf raise, and this is why a lot of people have the weights all the way stacked up to the top. First of all, oh, actually, I want you to come a little closer first and zoom in here. So when they're doing the calf raises, they're picking it all the way up. They're going one of two ways. They're picking it all the way up. We're going a quarter ways down, picking it up and going down, and then you'll see some kind of motion like this. And if that noise, if that noise sounds familiar, it's it's a uh, pretty customary in in normal commercial gyms. Or you'll see a quarter rep this way, and you'll hear the noise again. <laughs> so we call that the giddy up. All right, we don't want to do the giddy up. All right. So the whole point of doing a calf raise again is to. All right, we want to put a full stretch on our gastrocnemius, and then we want to shorten it, okay? So stretching it, we stretch it by lengthening it, okay? And then we shorten it by flexing it. Full calf raise from start to finish. You want to go all the way down, as far down as you can go. See how my Achilles is kind of stretched? Okay, and we want to go all the way pointing up. Camera man right over here real quick. So, the best analogy I've heard is think of yourself as a ballerina, all right? So what you want to think of is as you get tired, your toes are going to want to go out. And I'll show you what I mean in a second. What you want to do is make sure your toes are in, almost like you're pressing against the first two to three toes. As you get tired, you're gonna wanna go out, okay? What you wanna be able to do, or what you wanna do, is go up and in. Okay, so all the way down, all the way up, all the way down, all the way up. All right, we wanna avoid the giddy up. That's how we do a proper seated calf raise. All right, guys, so I cannot stress enough that you have to have full range of motion every single repetition. Here's a few different angles, so you can see all the way down, all the way up, all the way down, all the way up. Stop blaming your genetics for having a lack of calves and start looking at how you're exercising. Notice how my heels are going all the way to the top and I'm flexing my calves at the top and letting it get a full stretch at the bottom. Avoid the giddy up noise, guys. Avoid the giddy up noise, guys. Avoid the giddy up noise, guys. In review, guys, don't forget to lighten the weight. Get a full contraction at the top and a full stretch at the bottom. Try this out for a few months and you're gonna notice some significant size on your calves. Guys, if this video has helped you or enlightened you in any way, please do not forget to leave a like. It really helps the channel grow. Comment and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video.